the woke mind disease yeah. does it does exist. Yeah. And it does exist in uh, potentially anybody. Um, you know, people really got on Musk for saying woke mind disease. And let me tell you, he's got a woke mind disease now too. <laughs> I mean, and that's the that's the political situation we're in, basically. It's like he's not wrong that there is a woke mind disease on the left. I agree. But it, Trumpism is also a mind disease. Oh, absolutely. And, and um, man, some of these guys who used to be center right have gone full on, you know, like, yeah. like it, it, the way Trump either makes you go so far left, you're obnoxious, <laughs> or you're so far to him that you're insufferable. Okay. And can, here I am in the middle. Can I ask you this, though? Is it, do you look at Trump as a, uh, do you look at him from a comedic aspect, like standpoint? Like that's how I try to do. Because, okay, whatever he says is gonna be crazy as shit. A lot of it, a lot of it has to be fact checked because like, like, 90% of it is You can bullshit. just assume it's wrong. Right. Because he, I, I, I mean, I, I, that sounds snarky. It's just true. Because he would be the first to tell you if he could be rational about something. But he said it in so many words to other people in interviews that he's not even attempting to tell what's absolutely, like, factually true. No. It's sort of spiritually true. Like, you can't take it literally. Uh -huh. he, and he's not even tempting it. It just feels right to say, and then he'll pull something out of his ass, like unemployment, uh, the official is 3%. It could be, they say it could be up to 45. <laughs> well, it, it, it plainly could not. Right. And is, but he said things like, and he does it all the time. Um, so it's a tremendous superpower in politics because you do that constantly and no, no one expects you to make literal sense. Can you imagine what kind of advantage of that is in a, in a presidential race? Yeah. Not to have to make literal sense. He's got that going for him. Wow. He's, anyway, got, the, he's got the keys, but You do him? I do. Um, damn, I'm going to do it right now. I'm gonna hit the, I'm gonna hit no, the you chain. don't have to. Let's see how it is. No, I'm, I'm, no. Yeah, I'm, you're not a performing no, here. No, no, no. I'm just asking. No, I do. Um, I started, he was the last, he's one of the last ones that, I, at first I didn't want to do him because everything that, <laughs> everything that he stands for, I mean, everything that he's, he's everything a bad he's done. Man, yes. He's done some, he's, he's done He's a some bad guy. He's <laughs> just a bad guy. I don't like him. But then I started saying, well, if I, if I watch this guy, <laughs> Oh, that's great. If I absolutely look at this man. Wow. And I see exactly what he's trying to do. I'm basically, basically a genie in a lamp. Rub me, rub me, baby. <laughs> rub me, rub me the right way. And swear to God, uh -huh. people will die and no one will care. No one will care about the death. No one cares. Death, people die all the time, B. Hey, <laughs> just like Money Making Mitch said, like he said in paid in full. <laughs> in words, die, <laughs> die every day, B. They absolutely do. They die. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> I will not say it. My, wow. my yeah. ninth cousin, twice removed, <laughs> is an octoroon. <laughs> and I, <laughs> do I, can you still say that one? Hey, thanks for watching the clip. Hit the subscribe button now so you never miss out on our club random content that's posted daily.